Hey guys, what's going on? Bicepitron here from Clash of Clans Manual. This is another war recap video to some extent. A um, little bit of turmoil in the clan because we did lose our last war. And taking a look at it, uh, Beer Run. We've played them, I, or we've, not, we've matched up against them at least one time, maybe two. I actually don't remember, but I know we had one recently. And we actually beat them pretty handily, if I remember it right. Uh, they're actually in our war log, if we want to look down there um beer run there 77 to 57 uh 78 days ago so about you know two months a little bit more but we remember them and they have a pretty significant town hall advantage uh they had a few 9.5s which are always tough to go against and um we just didn't get the job done uh left a number of Town Hall 9s, 2 starred, and then the Town Hall 10s were very poor this war, unfortunately, and a lot was left 1 starred. And, uh, you know, they just got the job done better, so to speak. Uh, took out our bases better, good job in our Town Hall 10s, and then Town Hall 9s. They took out the bottom and the top, kind of. Uh, they had, including myself, I was 3 starred by their 13. They had a lot of uh, high-level guys coming down because they had a big Town Hall advantage, which is always tough if they can have some Town Hall 10s drop down and 3-star our Town Hall 9s. Anyway, this war, I'm just going to actually show both my attacks, which were 3-stars, because, one, we didn't have a lot of good attacks. I had a very good war, though. So I think I kind of want to just use this war to show off some of my attacks. Um, I did a live attack, which I recorded, but it didn't. the recording didn't go well. So, um, we'll just take a look at a few of my attacks and call this war good. And, um, nothing against the clan. A little bit of turmoil, but we'll sort it out. I just, uh, feel like I kind of want to show my attacks because I can really commentate them well. And I'm a little bit mad I didn't get a, I didn't get the live attack and I still want to show these. So, hope you guys like them. Uh, on this one, a few balloons. There was a possible double giant bomb spot there. Probably... And then here, a few balloons to take out those defenses, then a few hogs. Going to trigger uh, one of those bombs, which is probably the double set right there. Uh, good anticipation. I knew there would probably be a double giant bomb set there, based on how this base looks. Um, dragging everything out to the left, uh, which is a few barbers for distraction. Got my queen back, which is awesome. She's been upgrading for a long time, and she'll probably be going back to upgrading uh, in a w two wars or so. Um, CC kill goes good. Drop my golem here. Uh, creating my funnel with a giant and a wizard, a minion and a wizard up on the top. Uh, three wall breakers will take care of that. Get my troops going to the middle. King's going right in. And uh, this part just went really well. I was trying to do a two finger drop of the hogs, but for some reason they only went on one finger. And when I saw that Tesla, I panicked a little bit. I Dropped my heel way too early. Uh, so as you can see, they're almost making their way out of it at this point. Uh, but the king, queen was taken out while that happened. And the golem is still tanking. Queen is still up. And uh, these next two heels are very nice. Keeping my hogs up as they go through the base. Golem is still distracting all that point defense, which is awesome. Getting the full use out of that golem. And the other giant bomb was triggered. Didn't even affect many hogs. Now I'm stuck with this, this uh, last heal. I really only needed two heals for this base. So I go ahead and drop it on those hogs. Uh, but only those hogs get the benefit of it. So anyway, uh, still got a witch up, a golemite, some archers. Dropped a wizard for cleanup. Always drop that wizard as soon as possible. Almost right after those hogs get out and you drop your first heal. Quickly get that wizard down. He can start on cleanup on the opposite side because your hogs will finish on the other side. So the sooner the better you can save time like that. Even in the midst of things, uh, you know, be smart, get the cleanup troops down. And uh, the witch died to a few bombs, but have all the skeletons. And I just have a ridiculous number of hogs here. Um, I think maybe like 12 hogs, uh, maybe even more, just making your way through. Get that uh, three-star right there. Time wasn't even an issue, so really nice attack there. Uh, eliminated the double giant bomb spots, and then... Just going in, taking out the queen, and then uh, letting the hogs do the rest. Alrighty, we're looking at 42. And if you guys don't know the new update, I assume you do, 
Uh, there's that nice air sweeper there now, which we'll talk more about in a later video. I'll have an update video because there's also some uh, things they've done to prevent X mod, which I'll talk about. I'll have an update video coming out soon, so stay tuned for that. Uh, once I get some more gameplay of the actual uh, new stuff they implemented. Golem's down, uh, Wizard's uh, making my funnel. But notice how I don't drop the jump spell yet, because then my golems will be shot down. I want to wait for uh, the funnel to be made, my heroes to be down and almost going in, because that way uh, the golems are only tanking when necessary. Uh, they're not taking as much damage when they're outside, so I wait in the jump spell, make sure everything's in when I drop it. Uh, patient on the lightning, take out the witch. She can be pretty pesky. And uh, my king goes down pretty fast, but I still have like a whole golem that didn't die. And right here, the golem goes to one side, my queen goes to the other. But I use the ability, she takes out that Tesla. And even though the archer tower will lock back on to her, she'll have enough uh, hit points and damage to take out that air defense. Two air defenses, a uh, number of other buildings, uh, just for that kill squad. Now just the lava hounds coming down at different angles, backing up with balloons, typical stuff. Soaking up the air traps. Uh, first rage spell down. Making their way in, taking out that air defense, and uh, uh, Lava Hound from that angle, now working in the opposite direction. You can see the air sweepers actually kind of doing something to my balloons and my hounds, but not a whole lot. And uh, raging them, just keeping them moving. I think I won't, two of those Lava Hounds won't even bust, actually. So, uh, very quick attack, got it done, and it's just about cleanup now. My queen somehow stayed alive, I think. Uh, the Golemites tanked for her a little bit longer, and she got out of range of that one archer tower. Maybe it got taken out, I'm not sure. But, uh, anyway, two hounds didn't bust. That could be a time issue, but, um, I have so many balloons left, and it was a very quick attack, so no need, uh, for those hounds to bust. Time's not an issue. Still have the queen up to help with cleanup. Queen up to help with cleanup. Just figured out that rhyme. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys liked the video. Just two of my attacks. Um, I think I should show some of those more, cause, uh, especially when I have a nice war, because I don't want to you know, hold back the content just to show other people's attacks. But um, don't expect this every war, because I'm not perfect, and I mess up just as much as my clan mates. Um, that's it, guys. As far as the war goes, we'll take one more look at it. Um, just they got good job to be everyone. Hope we go up against them again. They're kind of going to be our rivals now. Uh, best two out of three thing going on so uh... more three stars and that's pretty much the story there so hope you guys like the video uh... stay tuned for the update video coming out soon that's gonna do it and i'll see you guys later by Sectatron out